Welcome everyone to the King of the Palace, brought to you by the New Palace Lanes here in Fitchburg, Massachusetts. I'm Steve Bronchuk. And I'm Dave Matala. And today we crown the king. Last week, reigning champ Tom Hirsch defeated Russ Geller. Now standing in his way, the number one seed, Tony Iannuzzi. The table is set. Let's get to the main course. Up first, reigning King of the Palace champion, Tom Hirsch, bowling at Orion's Family Amusement Center in Millis, Mass, with an average of a 108. This is for the King of the Palace, reigning King of the Palace champion, Tom Hirsch, defending his title against another newcomer in Tony Iannuzzi. Opening ball. Head pin. Look, Look at this. Look at this. Drops oh, a my bomb. Goodness. Way to wreck a rack. Talk about putting the pressure on on the first ball. Oh, this box delivery. Hey, Tom, Tom, has, Tom has nothing to prove, and he's already the king. He's mowed through three newcomers, four newcomers, and now he's working on another one. A little wide left in that one. Dropped that one. Look at this one. That's one, three, five, seven, eight. Yeah, this is pretty I don't think I've ever seen this one. I have. Never seen this. Oh, white right. Picked up big, maybe nine. No, he's got eight. He's the one start. seven. Piece of wood up against the one. Making his first appearance in the King of the Palace, the number one seed, Tony Iannuzzi, pulling out of Central Park Lanes in Boston, Mass, with an average of a 113. Up now on Alley 3, Tony Triple T Iannuzzi. Where's he out of, David? He lives in Winthrop, Mass. His home alleys are Central Park. Oh, so, oh yeah, those are the ones that uh, Dennis is going he uh, bowls in the men's retail league. And look at this, he's left the what? Oh, he's left the Kaleri. One, two, four, seven, and the nine. Let's see what happens. Let's find the hit. Oh, oh, look at this. Tony's average is a 113, his high single is a 190, and his high triple is a 448. He's been doing this for uh, 21 years. Up with the nine. Let's try to find the head pin. Keep pace. Looks to me like close to a one second bowler. He throws it. He throws it hard. He throws a rocket. For people out there viewing land and haven't heard the explanation, it's 60 feet from the foul line to the head pin. You throw the ball 42 miles, 41 miles an hour. The ball will be there in one second. Oh, that's a nice, nice soft touch on that. Look at this. Oh, oh he's, uh, got he's got it. He's got it. Backdoor strike. Backdoor strike. Last pin the ball oh, was the head pin. Oh my goodness, he wanted it. It's can't open bowling. How do you know it's ever going to happen? Flexed there his, it is. Flexed his muscles oh, on that one for the back door. That, I believe, is a, a Jameson, but we'll stop. I think it's a James. A James, okay, whatever. They'll correct. I'm excited. It's can't open bowling. Oh, it's from the King of the Palace. I'm sorry it's from the if this I'm keeps sorry. going. But that's what we wanted. Okay, Tom Hirsch. Oh, I left. Didn't want that. Okay, took out the half horse to left plus the fly. This is. A, Oh, this up. Well, left right hand side of the head and quarter. Yeah. Oh, strike ball. Oh, he's off. That's not good. Huh? See if he can't pick as many pins as possible. Well, we opened up the four boxes and he's ball got a strike. That's what we like to see. Picks up for the 10. Oh, nice 10. Excellent Camelton ball. Tom Hurst's average is a 108. His high single is a 213. His high triple is a 481. And Tom is getting four pins due to Tony's average. And he's kicking the palace. Right, right. Oh, oh, look at this. this. He's the one seven. One seven with some wood. I'm going right at the head pin. I'm going I'm to, gonna to see if I can go to Shame. the left of it. Yeah, yeah. Head pin. Just left. kiss it. Just kiss it. See what happens. It's like then the 
Oh, look at that. He went off to the right, picked it up. It's like a putt. Dennis says, reflection and reaction. <laughs> Better be careful. No, you don't want to. You don't want to quote Dennis wrong. I'll ask him next time. I, see him. I know we did make that statement. I got a note somewhere. Maybe we can have Travis stop. Yeah. Let me look. We want to take this opportunity to thank all the viewers out there for your continued support. Heck, we appreciate you know, it. all different. You know, um, comments. Access TV markets. Thank you very much. Oh, oh wow! What is this? He hit He's the He's on a strike. Hand. He throws the ball. Two, oh, four, my goodness. Five, six, seven, and the ten. This is ugly. Oh. He comes out of it with a six for one strike. What a beautiful first. Aces and eights left on the deck. Oh. Once oh. again, thank you, everybody, out in uh, local access TV land. Um, I can't do it without you. No, we can't do this show without the continued support that we get. And if you want to see local uh, chemical bowling in your neck of the woods, no matter where you may be, just contact your cable provider and ask them to say, hey, I want to see Kilipin bowling on TV. Right Off to the left. Right left. He's left an ugly six. Oh, five pit, maybe four. Oh, <laughs> they're still falling. They're still going. Oh, uh, the, the juice birds are going to be out tonight. Oh, well, he's got a slam. He's the his head. one, five, and the seven with a piece of wood up against, up behind the one. Try to push that one all the way back, just like that. And Beautiful pickup. Oh, nice shot. Excellent game of football. Very difficult to be made by Tony. Oh, oh man. Ball. Nice, nice spear shot. King of the Palace has got some competition against him this week. What do we got going? This match, yeah, I know. The King of the Palace. Oh, I thought maybe you, you were in. Oh, and, no. And getting Come something on, else no. like, the, you know, a pool tanner upstairs. Up on, here he goes. He's on it. Oh, let, oh, that one got away from him. No, didn't want that. Uh, we've seen both bowlers, a couple of bowls in the last couple of weeks, unfortunately, drop the ball in the spear field. But it happens. Picking up just the hit. So and he comes back with that disaster. Three, Dunno. five, six, and ten. Had nine pins up, hit the object, and only dropped four out of them. Oh boy. He's laboring a little bit here. Well, 58 for five. We've seen him we've seen him labor a little bit and come back and throw a ball. Oh, throw a ball, record. Right Look at this mess. <laughs> Three, six, four, eight, and a ten. What's this? Uh, aces and eight plus one? No, uh, a disaster. Oh, hits the head pin into in the pocket with the two, and then leaves this. And he drops one. I don't. I agree. Yeah, a little frustrated on that one. What can he do? Yeah. What can you do? It's can't up and it, it just sometimes you just don't know. There's no explanation for it. Nope. Tony Iannuzzi up working on a working on a spare. Body two plus the ball into the fifth box. String number one, lane number three. Here he goes. Getting ready to rock and roll. He knows what's on the line. Equipment you're adjustment. On, yeah. No, you're on TV. It's for the king of the palace. We all strive for it. It's the goal of every ball. Oh, look at this ball. Look at this. Oh, he found it. He's the seven pin. This wood on the deck should not be an issue. Go right at that seven pin. Takes it up. I want to say thank you to everybody on YouTube for um, viewing the king of the palace. Coming. Leaving your comments. Um, a lot of positive, com a lot of positive comments. A lot of comments from uh, everywhere, various states. Thank yeah. you very much. We truly appreciate do appreciate it. Appreciate you putting the effort in to get on. Please and continue on. watching and spread the word out in your neck of the woods. Oh, oh no, 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 no! I am not getting into it. 
<laughs> this, how Two, does four, that happen? Seven, three, six, how does ten. that happen? The man hits his object, and what does he get? On a spear, penalized. He gets the spread eagle. Uh, well, I'm not going to see this. We're also um, looking for sponsors, whether it be on your local access channel or on YouTube. Help support the King of the Palace, bring in more bowlers and larger prize money. Yo, know, it's um, affordable advertising for your local business. Yep. You know, or for your business, yep. whatever you may, whatever you Maybe we could get somebody to sponsor some non spread eagle shirt. <laughs> you like that one? Good luck on that one. <laughs> Maybe you can sponsor that one. Uh, man, I'm thinking about it. Oh, that is so frustrating. Defending champion, he's left the one. Uh, Leaves the high low jack with a joker. The three. This is difficult. High low jack with the queen. I'm just watching Tony come back after that. One, three, three, seven, and ten with a piece of wood. Very just a five pin would be. Oh, just off a little bit. Picks up. Well, we started out well. Picks up three of them. Oh, there it goes. Picked up the three, seven, and the ten. The head pin. And it, the finger of God is still waving at him. Nonetheless, this is still a pretty close match. Tom needs to do some work here. Newcomer Tony Eyes is uh, keeping the pressure on him a little bit. Very deliberate ball here. Lines up the ball and just lets it go. Just a just hair off, off in the, the head, head pin, pin, but he's left the spare lead. But he hits the head pin. One, three, and the ten. Should go right into the. Oh, he's going to for the wood to settle yeah, down yeah, up against yeah, the three. Yeah, nope. All right, run the, ladder. run the ladder. Off. Left. Oh. Knew it. Knew it as soon as he left the hand. Tom's still laboring a little bit. Tom's got blisters. Oh, look at this. Back door ten. <laughs> Tom's got blisters the size of Venus on his fingers. You wonder why what, what you see him doing, that's what he's doing. He's trying to squish those blisters down so they don't hurt so much. Triple T up. Yep. Trying to recover from that unfortunate spread eagle leave. Let's see what happens. Gotta throw the same ball again, Triple T. Nice way to wreck a wreck. Oh, what a hammer. Tony Iannuzzi. Three out of... He's got an what? 84 and two balls. Three out of the last four boxes, spares or strikes. And the one box that he didn't get in was an eagle, spread eagle throw. Uh, I think he's found his mark. Right, he's in a groove. Reigning King better do something in these next two boxes to build for the next match. Quite right. And he's like... The one, the two... Seven and the ten, the high low jack, and a joker with a king. Oh, a king, okay. A king is the two pin, and yeah, the joker. Uh, and, oh, okay. Whatever. Oh, well, I'm, you know, it's just, what, it's just whatever. I just, I'm just making this up as we go along. And he leaves the finger of God, better than one has the head pin. You know, I just want to make sure you have my yeah, terminology. I don't want to, you know, take. You know, that's all good. I just make up stuff as I go. 103 for Tony after right eight. Now he's got a 20 pin Tony lead over the King of the Palace. The, Tommy's got some work yeah, to do. The King's got to come through here. He's got to find. Actually, it. technically, it's a 16 pin lead because you have the. No, it's figured. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah. So it is a 20 pin lead. Okay, here he goes. The defending King of the Palace champions. Found, oh, he found the head pin. Oh, oh. why is it the 10 pin the only one to stand after dropping a bomb like that? Tommy's trying to push the cloud, the the sun, the, the clouds up, get the sunshine through it a little bit. Oh, short pinned it. One of that spear. One of that spear. He stood wide left. Okay, he's going to the box 10. He's gonna, gonna turn it on here. Tommy's been, Tommy's been uh, struggling the last couple of boxes. Yeah. Somebody with that strike. 
found the head pin this time. He's left four pins on the left. Two, four, five, and seven. Put some wood on the deck. But I want to touch the wood. I go right after the. I tried to try to run the ladder on the three side. Two no, he dropped it. He knew it. Yeah, he's a little frustrated. Yeah. He really opens the door up for T Triple T, Tony Eisenhuzzi. Uh, he's got a, Tony's got a lead on him now. Nice 10, though. Nice See 10. if Tony, uh, newcomer, Tony Eisenhuzzi can um, add a little bit of pressure onto Tommy. Yep, alley three, box number nine. Winds up, finds the head pin, and slams wow. it. Wow, leaves the two pin. Boy, does he throw that ball there. Yep, right. he's got to be a one He's got a, a nice release man. on it. He's throwing a right to left hook break ball. Nice rotation. Oh, he's yeah. no out about that. Boy, oh boy. Newcomer Tony Eisenhuzzi. Opening up a big lead on Randy King. And the Five locks out of the nine boxes. Excellent, Kim. Yeah. Turns it on a 113 right now. Plus a ball in the ninth. Let's see what happens. For the King of the Palace. Found it. Oh, wow. Eight drop. Eight pin drop. Maybe nine. Nope. Leaves the six and the ten with some wood in front of the six. Two pieces of wood in front of the six. Kind of an ugly leave right here. All right. I don't know. I would go. try to push that. I would try to see if I couldn't angle that second piece of wood in front of the six. Uh oh! oh. You, called you called it. Another took the, box. Took the front piece of wood, pushed Excellent. it around. Excellent. Move it. Yeah. Right now, 131 and a ball for newcomer Tony Iannuzzi. Really opened up the lead here. He opened up a can on. Six marks. Tommy. Oh, half worstered it. 133. That's another one. 133. 133 to 102. Tom Hirsch. This is the first time Tom has actually faced adversity that has been this large. He's never been in a hole. He's in a hole right now. 31 pin difference. He's got to hope that Tony um, that Tony falters a little bit, and Tom Tom can push the cloud the the, the, the clouds up into the sky a little bit longer to um, retain his King of the Palace championship. Up first string number two, alley number three, Tony Iannuzzi. Box number one to start it off. Let's see what happens. Off to the right. He's getting some late minute, last minute action. But there goes the head pin. But sometimes it's just your day. <laughs> yeah. Well, you know, I mean, he, he, you know, the sun kissed birds are going to be coming out any minute. Yeah, well, you know, he, he, he slid off the three pin into the six. He lets up, he just leaving the nine pin. Yeah, we'll Excuse see, me, the eight pin. We'll see how he plays this one. Oh, I would, you got to go way right. Way right. Yeah, you want to try to hit that V. Well, those two pieces of dead word are, are against the other one. Uh, or the other way. go right at it. He went the other way and it did pan out. That's why we're behind the camera and, and he's, he's up, up the there. Hour. But I'm kind of wondering if that's I'm, the way he was right, I'm going to ask him after the show if that's the way he played it. No triple T Tony. He'll Opening play. up with a spare. It doesn't matter how you do it. No, Balls right. stay on paper. It's an 8, 9, and 10. Oh, throws, wide right. throws it off to the right. Leaves the 1, the 2, up. and the 10. Seven out of 11 boxes. Boom. Almost done. There goes the 10. <laughs> and that 10 fell. But the two stayed. Well, where do you go? You can't get them all. Picks up the 10. Seven. All right. Open up one. Reigning King of Palace champion, Tom Hirsch. Down 31 pins going into string number two. Let's see if he's got anything left in the tank to retain his title. Tommy's 
been through a lot the past couple of weeks. You know, all newcomers facing different challenges, facing his biggest challenge yet. You know? Yeah, he didn't want to start off like that. Sore leg, sore hand. It's tough to pull all the strings and defend it. See what he can do, see if he can't have, see if he has anything left in the tank. See if he can't just push that pain aside and move forward. Uh, Tommy just said that he's done. Ah, uh, final Tommy, he's not done yet. He's not going to give anything away. Could have been just a, uh, a ploy. We'll see what happens. Well, he's left us 3 7 10. Got some wood. Left side or right side? Or head on. Um, I would try to push it off the left. Just like that. Boom, okay. boom. Nice, nice pickup, Tommy. Nice pick. Tommy's not done yet. Where did it go? Doesn't matter. I don't think it matters if we're the he's on. He's just throwing that. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Nine oh, pin drop. Goodness. It rocked, but it didn't fall. He's a seven pin. He's got some wood. This is a tough angle tough. on this one. Yeah, this is tough. Looks easy, but it isn't. He can't make any contact with that wood because it's it's going to avoid the shot. And yeah, plus it's. Oh, is he on or is he on? On the line. Is he on tonight or what? Excellent, excellent candle pin bowling. That ball had to be so precise. They couldn't make any contact with any two pieces of dead wood, and he got it. Yep. Threw the ball 63, 64 feet perfectly. When you got it, you got it. Working on the fill. Off to the right. right. Look at this disaster area he leaves. Only took out three. Leaves the one, two, four, seven, five, eight, and the nine. With a piece of wood up between the one and the two. Got to throw the this strike ball. ugly. Got to throw the strike ball to make the spare. Oh, and he nice pickup. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this. There, there, Nine marks he's, out he's, of not leaving, he's not leaving much. He's got nine vet. marks. He's got nine marks out of 13 marks. Well, and he's bowling for the king of the palace. Is that pressure? Yep. Be, uh, it's just like, I don't care. I want the crown. I give Tommy a lot of credit right now. Um, he's hurt now. Yeah. The know? defending. Def well, still got a shot, a double strike. You know, it's tough to get, but it would help. He's still hitting the head pin. Oh, he He's the three, six, and the seven. Yeah, he is, there is no quitting Tommy. Well, he's going to split these, throw it over, or go to the left of the three pin, hit the wood. Oh, oh look at that. Dropped it straight up in the air. He's looking up at the bowling guards. What happened? I don't know. Thought he had it. Tommy had a great run. Yeah. I think he's just uh, stepping around to gas a little bit. Oh, it's, unf it's just unfortunate. Probably he one of those things where he just, he probably just needs a little five-hour energy. Red Bull or... Well, that or Tony, Tony Triple D, my goodness. Nine times out of 14, oh, 10. Oh, head and quarter. He's still got some authority on that ball. He's left the floor right from spare with ugly wood. This is yep. going to be difficult. Just try to push that piece of wood straight. This is one of the ones where you want to cap it. Oh. Yeah. Saw that coming. Uh, it's like um, Tommy can't take anything off because if he takes anything off from his ball, he can't control it. And if he throws it too hard, it hurts. Okay, after four, we've got Tommy and Hershey, 44. Triple T Tony at 50 plus a ball. Plus a 31 pin lead. Yes. This is getting pretty... Uh, pretty distant. Pretty distant. Yeah. The champ is... He's hurt. 
triple T A. Off to the right, left. off to the left, left, excuse me. And he still drops he's up. He's the one, three, and the seven. Still drops up. Yeah, he throws that ball hard, and he's got a little uh, English on he's it. He's no, no doubt about it. He's a one-second man. Yeah, you know, but, oh, well, uh, <laughs> no <laughs> comment. <laughs> Second. No oh. comment. <laughs> okay. <laughs> He's going after a oh, And Come on, get over there. Spinning it around. Look at this. Use the seven pin. He's going to wait for the woods. No, he's not going to win. One thing I can turn around and say about this is, is uh, the Candle Pen Bowlers, man. Everybody knows that the reigning king of the palace, Tommy, Tommy Hirsch, is hurt. But everybody is rooting him on. You know, even Tony Iannuzzi is uh, you know, egg, egging him on to you know, keep pushing. Yep. Yeah, that's all we can do. That's candle pin bowling is one big bunch of this functional family. <laughs> Couldn't say it better myself. Throwing that ball hard leaves the five and the nine all alone. Well, this is what it's all about. Two pinners. No wood. You gotta throw the ball down there. You gotta make contact with the five and split it. It's up to you. Oh, little fall. Leaves the nine pin. It happens time and time again. Ball hits the ball pin and goes straight up in the air. Yep, you just never know. You just never know. Okay, a little this pump between the two competitors. Obviously, the king of the pals knows he's in trouble. He's got to make up 32 and 2 to stay even, plus the 31 deficit. He's got a long, big hole. Oh, big take it the box of the 60 something pins down right now. Quarter. Come on. Come on. Really? That was a beautiful ball, Tommy. Should have been more. Everything that Tommy has, he's throwing at that, and he's that time he got penalized. Picks up the spare. Tommy's not done yet. I take my hat, my tip my hat to Tommy. Okay, he's working on the spare. Lane number four, box number six. Eight, nine, and ten. Eight, nine, and ten. Well, a little weak through a weak ball, but he's left. He dropped six, left the one, the three, the Tommy seven. Doesn't have any skin. Tommy skin. doesn't have any skin left on his fingers, man. He's bowling with his bones. Look at this. This is just this is just plain guts right now, man. Finger going up, heel it down. Ten. Pick that for a ten. After six, we got 76 for Triple T Tony, and 70 for the defending king of the palace, Tom Hirsch. Yeah, if, if uh, so Tommy Tommy doesn't find a way to dig himself out of this hole pretty quick, this is going to be over, like in the next two boxes. Hopefully, you know, Tommy's probably hoping that Tony falters just a little bit. Tommy really, Hirsch. Really tried. Guts and glory, man. Okay, we got a two penny here. Hit the head pin, should take it right out. One and two. Two pieces, three pieces of behind the two. Picks it up for a spare. No doubt about it. Perfect. So I'll let him in all, all elementary now. There's a classic case of a man delivering the bowler delivering the ball. It could be a you know, lady bowler, a man bowler. You know, I don't ball. think, you know. To be honest with you, yep. I think the only thing that stopped Tommy from uh, opening up a can is just the surmountable injuries that he has. You know, he's got a bad wheel and he's always got blisters, blisters on his fingers and from facing challenger after challenger and just really after a while the body just says enough. Got a fourth pin set yeah, I take I take my hat off on. All the credit in the world. Tommy has nothing to prove. Well, he had the king of the palace for a month. Well, he had the king of the palace for a month, and then he mowed through three new competitors, and he just ran in. You know, his body just didn't have enough in the tank to go up against another newcomer in Tony Iannuzzi. Now, Tony Iannuzzi triple D's got 10. But I don't think this is the last time we've seen Tommy Hurst. 
I wouldn't be surprised. He's got four boxes left. I would love to see him drop a bomb in one of these four boxes just to say I still have something left. It doesn't matter how it goes, just as long as it goes. Left Leaves the one, three, eight. Yep, with pieces of wood up against the one and the three. Up. No quit, Tom. No, no quit, Tom Hirsch. He's the defending champion. Very difficult to pull. Rough fingers getting down to the bone. He's been doing, he's been battling. Every ball, box, no quit. His fingers have got to be killing him. No, he's dropped five. He's left an ugly leave. One, eight, six, nine, and ten. No, just slam the head pin to the, the right, maybe. Don't. Trying to spray and pray a little bit. Yeah, Tommy is all out of gas. Look at that. I think it. I think it, I think it is over. all over. We are going to have a new king of the palace champion and newcomer Tony Iannuzzi. It wasn't that Tom didn't have anything left in the tank. I think his body just started hurting a little bit more. It takes a toll on your body. And Tommy is just waiting. He wants this to be over. Okay, he dropped seven. He's left the one, the two, the six. One, two, four. <laughs> Excuse me, one, two, four. The Pieces queens leave left. Yeah. So what happens, box number nine, the foundation box. One and oh. That one kind of dropped out of his hand a little bit. He's left with the finger of guard for the 10 box. Let's see what happens. Uh, congratulations to Tony Iannuzzi. He, um, he tried qualifying last month and fell short. Now, came back, qualified as a number one seed. Take on Randy King of the Palace, Tom Hirsch, and in dramatic fashion, defeated Tommy Hirsch. The stat really helped. I'm pretty sure, though, Tony, Tony. If I know Tony the way I know Tony, he think I think he would rather have wanted to face Tommy 110 percent. My hat goes off to Tom Hirsch. My hat goes off to Tony Iannuzzi for uh, defeating Tom Hirsch. Well, and I know if Tom Hirsch had, you know, was healthy, I'm pretty sure that you would see him uh, do what he's been doing for the past couple of weeks. Up to four horsemen left. One, two, four, seven. Well, Tony. Triple T finishes with a 251, and he will be the new king of the palace. Congratulations, Tony Iannuzzi, and congratulations, Tom Hirsch, for showing us all the guts and the grit that you had as the king of the palace champion. We appreciate it. Oh, nice pickup. Nice we hope that this isn't the last time we see you. Well, Triple T, Tony Eisenhower. We'll be walking down Cleveland Street, River Street, Kimball Street, East. He'll be going back home to uh, Winthrop, Mass. They can wear the crown down there. We'll let Travis yeah, let him wear it down there. Let's promote him. Let's get up and bowling. Look at this. Come on, fall down for Give it to him. Give it to him. Well, it's close to it. Close to One, the three left. How does that happen? <laughs> Tom still gets a good sense of humor rolling around. Oh, it's candle pinball. That's all you can do. Oh, listen to the blue birds. Being heckled by the new King of the Palace champion. The King of the Palace. Triple T, Tony Iannuzzo from Iannuzzi. Iannuzzi, excuse me. Defeating the reigning king, Tom Hirsch. Now former king of the palace champion, now reigning king. Congratulations, Tony Iannuzzi, on becoming the new king of the palace champion. Tony, eight spares and two strikes. 
And Tommy's one spare and one strike. Congratulations to the new King of the Palace champion, Triple T, Tony Iannuzzi. He is the new King of the Palace. Yeah, that was a great match between the two of them. Tom Hirsch, the former King of the Palace, showed a lot of grits and a lot of stamina, but came up short against Tony Iannuzzi. Up now, the Spread Eagle Challenge. Up first in the bonus ball challenge, new King of the Palace champion on Alley Fort, Tony Iannuzzi. It's not the, it's the spread eagle challenge. Let's emphasize this to the viewing public. Bonus ball spread eagle, eagle. challenge. Uh, now up, former King of the Palace champion, Tom Hirsch. See if he's got anything left in the tank for one ball to see if he can't collect some bonus money. And it's what the Spread Eagle Challenge. Spread Eagle Bonus Ball Challenge. Oh. Unfortunately, we do not have a winner of the Spread Eagle Challenge. We'll see you all the next time on the King of the Palace. Thank you very much, and have a great night.